Yo, what's up, guys? And we're back with more Kaizothon. Ye. You might notice the title of this title screen is Super GDF World. And that's because this hack slash level was made for a design challenge by uh, the speedrunner formerly known as GDF, currently known as RetroBob underscore. Uh, but the name of this level is Cadaverous Chains, and I believe it is shown on the overworld. It is just a one exit level. Um, I'm going to guess it's going to take about two hours, but we'll see. I did beat it before, but that was 2016, so who knows how this is going to go. Uh, so yeah, let's get started. Um, if you don't know, FT was the creator of Super Responsible World. And uh, this level is only slightly more ethical, so here we go. I apologize for the seismogram difficulty curve. Haha, -ha, did I scare you? So I believe the prompt for this one was a ghost house. I don't exactly remember, but I think it was. All right, cadaverous chains and something else. What is this? Life farm. Oh, we actually need this, right? Yeah, let me just do this real quick. So I just put new pads in my controller last night, so I forget how this level goes. Good start. No retry. <laughs> uh, I forget how to do this, but I guess we're going to learn pretty quickly. And you gotta wait on the bubble. Okay, good start. Yes! 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 Good luck. Oh my gosh. Go uh, yo, Pookie Lassard, thank you for the 21, one, 21 months. Welcome back. Well, there's there's no saving this, is there? No. <laughs> Hello, Fazzy Waz. <sighs> so I kind of got to swing it out, I think, just to build up a little bit of speed. So we'll see. There we go. Oh my goodness. We have unethical, uh... Oh, okay, I see what that does. We have unethical white spikes that blend with the background. Oh my gosh. Is the game sound a little bit low? I did turn it down just a bit. Because it was set for race settings last night. I turned it up a little, so that's probably better. Gosh, this is gonna be fun. Oh man. Yeah, the boo ring doesn't reset, so you gotta kinda play it as it lies.
Ah, get over there. I think I just don't want to trigger that boo at all. Yo, Nefarious Mage, thank you for that fresh sub. Welcome to the Polyhedra. Really appreciate it. Yeah, you just don't want to trigger the booze at all. Well, yeah. One eerie. Probably like a fake checkpoint or something, right? Let us sacrifice many Marios to the best designed SMW sprite. Bish and Foo. Yo, I think I still have that FFZ emote. Type in, type in Bish and Foo. Do I still have it? I do. Hooray. I'm happy. Alright, we got a... This feller here. Oh, okay, yeah, it starts you at a weird, like, screen position. So as soon as you move, the camera's gonna move. This is actually kind of genius, but it's also really trolly. This, like, as soon as I move, the camera's gonna move. And, yeah, Fish and Boo's gonna go flying. Ten out of ten. Okay, that's what you do. Yo, Tycho. Big jump. The normal jump there and then spin off the other side. No, that's not a halfway point. There will be, I believe there are multiple checkpoints. If I remember correctly. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no! Gosh, that was it. Ugh. I don't know if that's intended, but uh, what we did. Everyone's so excited. They're like, you actually beat Combo Killer? No. I encourage you to look at the VODs if you care. <laughs> that camera yo thanks Atari have a good night dude Oops. 28 months twitch prime hi do dice yo Raider boy 5 thank you for 28 months of twitch prime that's like actually insane dude I really appreciate that and that is, like, not even a missed day, because I believe the 16th is my anniversary day. Thank you so much. Ah, dang it. I think riding the fish and boo is probably the easier way to go. I know, Dan. It's almost a year in a row. Oh my gosh.
10,000 years will give you such a crick in the neck. Laser derp. Howdy, hot bread slices. This is the laser. Okay. What's up, Dr. Barber? Alright, these buttons aren't too bad that I'm that I replaced. They seem pretty good. They just def they feel different, they're a lot less clicky. Don't step left at all, because the camera shifts as soon as he moves. Ugh, it's such a troll. Checkpoint, please. <laughs> That's such an FT move. Okay, yeah, that is a checkpoint. <laughs> that is such an FT move, though. I didn't disable scrolling. That's impressive. Although I can't respawn the guy because it's... I remember this room being especially hard. The classic weave. The old GDF and weave. Nice uh, no block graphic there. Yo, Disco Monday, what's up, dude? Oh, that's a dode tip. Okay. We got uh, the classic black death blocks. Yes! 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 Yo. Yo. Oh, I bonked. Okay. Uh, Intergon 5, thank you for the six months with the Twitch Prime. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Where am I going? Not there. 
Oh my gosh, it doesn't end. <laughs> I think I need to ride that, but I do think I need to normal jump and not spin. I'm like, like, I'm not worried about this level because it's something I've beaten before. But it's just been so long and it's one level. Like, I don't really remember it very well. I just remember struggling. What if I just hold jump and run and run left? Don't even worry about jumping in that corner. Nice tip. Uh, suggestion to make Kamek harder. Essentially just make phase one not waiting. So like the very first floating note block section, you basically just wait for 15 seconds every time you uh, enter the fight. I didn't mean to do that. I would like to see you, if, if not cut that out, uh, then at least just entertain the player, is what I would suggest. Do I have to sneak that in one go? That doesn't seem right. I think this might have been the part that I struggled with most, honestly. My memory serves me correctly. Okay. Is the boo laser gonna go up the hole or not? I can't really tell. I would assume not. If it does, that limits our options and would make it easier, but I'm assuming it's not going to. Alright, so... Dang it, I, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to just spin. So we have to we have to spin off the guy. There's no way I'm normal jumping off the Cooper and living. Alright, so spin for sure. Or just stay on it. That might be it. Maybe just stay on it. Yep, this is indeed cadaverous chains. Mm -hmm. 
All right, so stay on the gray. And then do something else. Stop bonking. Yes, I changed uh I changed combo killer. It's Kaizo hard now. So you don't want to do that. My opinions on it are literally just change or remove the last level and it's fine. That's pretty much it. It's unfortunate. Oh, okay, right under that, maybe. The whole jump when we land. Okay, I think I see what to do. I'm not certain. Alright, so like... that okay but faster uh xander thank you for the 28 months welcome back really appreciate it what was wrong with the last level well it took about two hours to beat with safe states <laughs> so yeah Okay. So I have to hit the turn block late. Okay. I think I see what to do. Thank you. We're on the home stretch for this section. Uh, uh, no, that's the white spike ceiling. <laughs> yeah, two hours to beat with safe states and it had one checkpoint, so, I mean... After about seven hours, roughly, uh, I got. Oh, I get back there. I got about well, I don't know thirty percent of the way to the checkpoint, but about the next two jumps were harder and more unreasonable to learn than anything else in the level before of what I played. So. It is absolutely not feasible or reasonable for anybody to learn and play that. Last boo in the line. But yeah, you can, uh... You could spend, like, a Chain Chomp Raiden amount of hours on that level and still not beat it. Pretty sure that's a safe place to draw the line. It's a shame too, because the rest of the hack is pretty good.
Oh gosh. In there? Is that really it already? That's it. What? Dude. I don't know. Okay. Can we just like stop analyze what just happened? What do I do for the rest of the stream, right? All right. In 2016, this took like three hours. That level took about three hours in 2016. So this is just like, I guess, a good demonstration of how far we've come. I was fully anticipating that to take like three hours, maybe two. But I was not expecting 25 minutes. I... Oof. Man. Okay. So we're on a whole nother level now. <laughs> uh, Alright, hey, we got 15.